hey hey today is wednesday <laughs> and i am going to go out to do some errands so we are going to go possibly to either best buy or office depot but i haven't really decided yet so i'm going to decide as i drive up to the corner <laughs> which one i'm going to go to i think i'm leaning more towards See, I want to go to the neighborhood where the office, I'm sorry, where the Best Buy is, but I probably really need to go to Office Max. So let's see. Okay, I'm in Office Depot. Okay, so I'm back outside. I ended up getting my mom a new laptop for Christmas because the one she has is old. And for some reason it's messing up and I don't know what's wrong with it. And I don't even think I got a warranty on it. So I made sure that I got a warranty on this one. It was a pretty good deal. It came with Word. I mean, not Word. I'm sorry. It came with Microsoft. came with a free sleeve, a free mouse. Um, and I got a warranty. So it was a pretty good deal. Uh, I'll talk more about it. Uh, I guess that... Well, no, I'm not going to post this right now. So she won't be watching this video. Uh, I will leave... Well... It, it probably won't be on sale. Um, honestly, it probably won't be on sale. What do you call it? Um, by the time I post this video. But it was from Office Depot. Uh, yeah, so definitely check out Office Depot. I was going to go to Best Buy. But since this one had... Um, I was able to get a, a four-year warranty. And the laptop was like 50% 50 50 off. So it really was a better deal. Even though I did want to get the one from Best Buy, but this one just made more sense to purchase. You feel me? All right, so there is a new place, a new restaurant that I just passed called Wiley and Rum. I may go there because, you know, I like trying new restaurants. So going to go there. Definitely going to go to Morelli's because I got to give me some cake and I might give me a smoothie. The mango smoothies. If you ain't been to Morelli's, Morelli's is in East Atlanta, Edgewood area. It is so good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's so good, baby. It puts Brewsters down. It really do. I love me some Brewsters, but this is it. So, yeah, about to get in the, well, in the car. They just opened up a Marshall's. I was thinking about going over there. I put the laptop in my trunk. Maybe if I make a couple of whips around the parking lot, nobody will notice me and I can run up in that. Well, you know what? No, I don't even need to go to Marshall's. I need to take my butt home and I need to finish my homework. That's what I need to do. Okay, enough rambling. Let's go. Okay, so this is what I ended up with. I think these are going to be cute. All right, I'm out of there. I picked up a few items and now I'm out. I put on this coat. I'm glad I put on my coat with no sleeves because now I'm hot. I'm walking to the car because I parked in this, um, what do you call it? Garage because they ain't have any spaces in the front. Now I'm about to go, um, get some of this new restaurant food and take my butt to the house and get to work, honey. Get to because it was a lot of reading that we had to do for that class. I was like, oh, Lord, I wasn't ready. Hold on, wait a minute. Get all this in. I was just thinking, why is it every time I'm in the store and I have a big item, I have to ask for a bag? That shit is so annoying. Like, girl, give me a bag. Ooh, hold on. There I go. Ooh, okay, so I'm going to tape a little short video when I get to that restaurant, too, if I can, to a place a to-go order. Of course, I'm stuck in traffic. Look at this. Do you see it? Do you see it? All right, I made it out. Baby, that parking lot was tight. <laughs> now I'm trying to figure out how in the hell to turn up in this parking lot of this restaurant. I'm going to turn it right here just to be safe. Okay, I found it. Now I need to find a space. Oh man, I hope I didn't lose my mask. I had to pull this one out the car. I'm hoping it fell in the trunk. 
but I couldn't open my trunk because of where I'm at. But we'll see when I get in here. Strawberry pound cake Sunday. I've never had this here before, but the pound cake in itself is popping. Um, and then I got a just mango smoothie. They have different flavors. They have strawberry banana, mango pineapple, strawberry pineapple, but I just like mango only. Here's the menu. I don't know if you can even see the menu that well. Oh, they're making that noise again. Let me turn this off. Okay, so this is it. My cake. <laughs> All right, so got my cake, got my mango, just mango smoothie, and this is the pound cake. Can you see it? There we go. So now I'm headed back home. It's a wrap. Okay, so we got the chicken empanada, the beef empanada. Wait, that might be beef. Okay, anyway, and the island burger. Yeah. Hey, good morning. So today is Friday. I'm headed to get something from someone that I purchased, some, a table that I purchased on Facebook Marketplace. It is 20 degrees outside in Atlanta. It was storming so bad last night. Literally, I had to call my best friend like, wait a minute, what is going on? Even though she doesn't live in Atlanta, I just needed someone to keep me busy talking so I wouldn't have my mind focused on how bad those trees were rumbling and shaking last night. Let me tell you a funny, why is this the first time I wore a winter coat all year and the first time that I've wore shoes all year? Like, I have been wearing Crocs for I've been wearing Crocs for so long, I don't even remember when I started wearing them. But I know today is the first day that I put on shoes, so you know it's cold. Okay, so this is the table. As you see, I had to put it in the, well, we had to put it in the front seat. The girl helped me. Um, I actually knew some people that she knew from uh, college. So, you know, that was a small world, right? All right, so I'm pissed. So, the table put a hole in my windshield because some dummy jumped in front of me and slammed on brakes. I was literally five minutes away from the house, so that really made it bad or worse. <sighs> I've got to get these trees cut. You hear that? That's some trees, child. Anyway, um... Sorry, um, so that kind of cut into what I wanted to do the day after Christmas. The day after Christmas, I wanted to go to Home Goods. I wanted to go to Target, but because of that, it put a monkey, monkey wrench in my plan. So my car will be in the shop. I am not going to get a rental car because it's the holiday. I'm not going to be working, so I'm not going to waste the money on a rental car. So I'm just gonna have to order everything that I wanted to get online. Well, I won't even say everything that I wanted to get because it's home goods. I didn't know what I was going to get, you know, or Target. So I just will have to order everything online or some things online. Why do I keep saying everything? Some things online that I see and move on with my life. And I need to place a grocery order. So I guess I have to place that for delivery. But that's not nothing out of the norm because, child, I, um, trying to get out this sun, I, um, would definitely be ordering online. So that ain't nothing new. It just feels weird when you know, can't go nowhere. Well, you could, but you know what I mean. But anyway. All right. That's enough for this moment. I will see you guys shortly or later. And of course, this is a picture of my windshield. How tragic. And I almost forgot, this is the table. It comes from West Elm.
Okay, so today is Friday, and for dinner, we are having oxtails, rice and beans, or rice and peas, and macaroni. The macaroni look kind of suspect, but we'll see. Let's look at the other one. This is the second one. And for drinks, we have pineapple. All right, so today is Saturday, and we got some This Is It. This is the brisket with cheese and onions and this is supposed to be a barbecue chopped sandwich with barbecue sauce with chicken chicken what is it called barbecue chicken chopped sandwich but as you see they didn't gave me one slice of bread where's the other and then you know macaroni greens and then i also got a half a gallon of the lemonade just to try it out so let me go ahead and try to piece this together and make a sandwich. Yeah. For Christmas dinner, we had a few cowboy steaks, macaroni, and veggies. That's what today is. Bam. The day after Christmas. Welcome back to my channel. Let's get this week started now. Okay, so it is Monday morning and I'm at the car dealer getting our car service. We're not service. I had to drop it off because, as you saw in the previous clip, I, um, broke the windshield yeah but funny thing the small world so i was here and ran into a girl that i know and she was actually going to bring me home but realized that i live on the other side of town and she was going the opposite way so she was like oh uh, yeah no but it was a good gesture it was you know nice she asked so right now i'm just waiting on my uber ride to head back down towards the house hmm. sorry are so crusty but it's because it's so cold and it's so early it is about 10 now though but i left the house at like nine anyway my uber ride should be here i will pick this clip back up in a few minutes look at this why every time walmart sends something it's always tore up and broken i'm hoping you see that hole i'm hoping that the blender is not tore up as well so this is the blender we got so let's open it up and see. Ooh, it's so. All right, so this is the blender right here. Cute. So I just got it because it was like a white cream color to match the cream decor. Don't mind this air fryer. We're gonna clean that off and put that in the um cabinet. Okay, so right now I'm online looking for some stuff to buy. <laughs> it's the day after Christmas and I'm pissed because I wanted to go to Target. But you know, my car is in the shop. And they didn't have any loaner vehicles available, so that pissed me off. Talk about, oh, we don't have any loaner vehicles available to the end of January. Wait. So, I didn't want to get a rental car for it to just sit in the garage. Oh, look at my hair right there. Anyway, I don't want to just get a rental car for it to just sit in the garage. So, I cannot go to Target until I get a vehicle. Or... Yeah, 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 yeah. I just wait till I get my car. But I'm definitely going to go shopping online. Right now, I'm waiting for our food to come. We ordered Uber Eats from Red Lobsters. So that should be here shortly. And I will show you guys what we purchased. Okay, I made it to the front door. Let's get our food. Ooh, la la. Yes. So we got pineapple drinks. Look at this. Look at this. This ain't even a really a full scoop in my opinion. Look at that. And then look at this cake. Child. Okay. Okay. Focus. 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 Okay. So we got fish. Salad. I mean, and I want to tell you a handful of salad. Then I got this for dessert. This is why I was like, why they give me that little bitty scoop of ice cream. And then let me open this up. This is coleslaw and coleslaw and then they gave us these biscuits but the biscuits maybe they could have uh, made them fresh but on a positive note this was the kitty meal so it was only about ten dollars a piece okay so the toaster has arrived and it matches the blender and matches this here with the little 
Okay, so today is Tuesday and my television has come in the mail. I just got something small, something basic to put in the room to watch. And I like to project my laptop onto the screen sometimes. So just got something that small. So I'm getting ready to take it out the box and see exactly how small it is. Okay, so this is the TV. It's actually clearer than what you see. I'm watching a very old movie, The Shining, so that's why it looks kind of, you know. But not a bad deal for a hundred bucks. So today we are eating chili again with our favorite honey cornbread, the Jiffy honey cornbread. Okay, today is Wednesday and I am making tacos for dinner. And I am eating my chili for lunch. So I'm gonna eat chili for lunch, but I wanna oh shoot. Go ahead and make the Oh gross. I gotta clean that up. Okay, ugh. Okay, so for dinner we are having tacos. And uh yeah, what lettuce I don't I don't I don't really care too much for tomatoes on my taco. You don't? No, not really. So lettuce, tomato. No, sorry, no lettuce. I'm sorry, no tomato. <laughs> so lettuce. Feta cheese and regular um shredded sharp cheese. All right, it's still Wednesday and I got these and these and the pink ones from um from Walmart for $11.99. If you do decide to pick these up, please get a size larger because honey, they just fit. All right, so good afternoon. Today is Thursday and I'm headed to get my vehicle. It's finally ready. Okay, I finally made it to Big Lots. Child, look at this parking lot. Ain't nobody out here but me and the birds. You see Big Lots? There's so much sun out here today. Woo! All right, let's go in. Why did a man in the store ask me if I worked here? Do I look like I work here? Okay, so right now I am traveling back down towards the city. Right now I am in the Midtown West Side District of Atlanta. I decided to stop by. Can you see it? Ooh, can you see it? I don't think you can see it. Let me go up. There we go. I decided to stop by CB2. Walked in and immediately saw some Christmas trees. They were $23 for the uh, mini one. So I bought the last three for next year. And I just walked around, came up across some more sale items. So you know I had to get them two leather pillow inserts and they are right here child i'm sitting in the parking lot of slim and huskies in the west end okay so it is still thursday night i went to slim and huskies never been there before so i wanted to try it i got one slim pizza and one husky pizza so the slim is the smaller one and this is chicken and then the husky is this larger one and this is salmon. So let's try it out. Then I got these two non-alcoholic drinks. And I forgot the flavors, but I'm going to taste them and we'll see. And they also have alcoholic frozen drinks as well. All right, so today is Friday. And as you see, I need to wash my hair, but we will worry about that this evening. Right now, I'm just running to a Publix grocery store to pick up a few items for next week because guess what? Next week I gotta go back to work. Next week is work. Can y'all see me? Let me see if I can open the garage. It's real dark in here. Hi, it's me. So, um, but yeah, so uh, that's really about it because I overspent yesterday at Big Lots. I really did. Um, no, I'm lying. I didn't overspend at Will you? Yeah, I overspend at Big Lots and I overspend at CB2. I taped a little bit of CB2 before my phone died and then I didn't have my charger. Yeah, but I will show you what I picked up from there uh, probably later or tomorrow. Yeah, so let's hit the road. Okay, I forgot to mention that I got this um, Popeye's chicken for lunch. All right, today is Saturday morning, and I'm just having some of the silk yogurt, granola, and strawberries. 
Hey guys, good afternoon. Today is Saturday, New Year's Day. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Okay, anyway, like I got somewhere to go. Anyway, I am on my return churn. I want to get all of my returns out of the house before the new year so we can start fresh. So I have this, remember that? I need to take that back to CB2. I need to take the knobs back to CB2 and I need to take a random little small pieces back to home goods so let's go all right so i finally made it well not finally because y'all don't stay that far away i mean oh ain't no parking spaces what's up okay so i just left cb2 cb2 girl oh i've never been in a well yes i have but this store is outrageous. The store is not that big. They always have more than too many, more than enough people working, but they're always not working. They're always huddled in a bunch, talking to each other, not helping the customers. I don't, I'm the type, like if you're, what's the purpose of having all these people working if nobody is working? You might as well just have one or two people in the store. Why you got four or five people on shift and y'all all huddled in a, Y'all all huddled in a group talking. Like, this is why I order online because these stores, customer service is dead. These people think they just supposed to just stand around. I, I don't understand it. Anyway, well, I am headed all these bumps and potholes, but I'm headed to Home Goods now up the street. I don't really care too much for this Home Goods, but it's up the street, so um why not i'm just doing some returns anyway so it don't really matter child this the um this that by that walmart they had one of the i don't know what section it was in the store but one of the sections they had somebody had set some stuff on fire in the walmart like walmart this is why i be like i'm not like dealing with walmart because it's always something can you move girl these people can't drive I, i'm sorry but people need to get it together what are you edging out for and i'm going because if you run into my door it's gonna be on sorry i'm just getting real annoyed like people don't drive for the environment people drive for themselves like are you blind do you not see other cars around you you can't just do what you want to do okay i'm getting annoyed let me calm down Oh yeah, ooh, it say Walmart is closed until further notice. I knew it. Yep, this the Walmart. I need to call my friend. She used to work here. This is it. It says closed until further notice. This Walmart off the chain anyway though, but that's another story. And you would think where it's located that it wouldn't be. But well, honey, people done messed up this polo. Uh, oh, I forgot to hit a TJ Maxx up here. I'm gonna run in this TJ Maxx too, just to see since it's right up the street. Oh, La Perilla. Maybe I might give me a La Perilla to go because I sure want a pina colada. Ooh, that pina colada be so good. <laughs> anyway, okay. I'm too excited, I know. Let me get off of here and go and find my parking space. All right, so this is where I am. This is Atlantic Station. Well, no, this is not Atlantic Station, but it's not that far away. All right, so... Oh, is that a parking space? Oh, yes, honey. Thank you. Okay, so as always, we tried a new restaurant this week. It is called Southern Southern Queens on Memorial. And this is the salmon, macaroni, and greens. Of course, I had to try their pound cake. You know, I love me some pound cake. Queen. And now, I've never heard of a restaurant selling turkey necks. So this is the turkey necks, macaroni, and greens. So we shall see how this tastes. Again, this is Southern, Southern, I always be messing up. Southern Queens with a Z. And this was the inside, empty as can be, but we tried it anyway. Thank you guys for tuning in. I will see you in the next one.